guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video, which is a part two, nearly swore that you are, um, part two of what's in home bargains. So this is um, what I bought from home bargains. I was literally just going in to show you guys what's what. I ended up spending £100, but I got some good stuff. I got some like normal house stuff, a bit of food, a bit of cleaning, Christmas decorations and some Christmas gifts. So, if you want to see what I bought from Home Bargains, then keep on watching. So, I'm just going to start with the boring bits first. One, it's got blue some biscuits because it needed some more biscuits. And I think for that big bag, it was either $2.99 or $3.99, which I think is really good, even if it were $3.99. Um, we needed just some more dilute juice. Now they have the Robinsons, like a big one for £2, but I didn't need a big one. And these are the only like smaller ones I had. So I've got the Vimto one. And this is the Real Fruit Squash. And that was £1. I'm gonna, oh my God. Get down. she's not allowed on the work top um right so this is where i'm going to have to put him showing you the juice i just needed some toilet rolls so i've got these but these actually look like super thick does it say what ply they are they're only a three ply but honestly if you could feel these these are super thick and cushiony um so you get 12 and they were three pound 50 i'm sure and I think that's actually really good for 12 and they are cushiony. If you know, you know, I got two boxes of wine days. Kids, I don't know if Ellie eats them actually. Lydia definitely loves them. They're made with real fruit. So if your kids won't eat fruit, then these are perfect. Lydia does eat fruit, but she doesn't like taking it in a lunch box because her hands get sticky and whatever. So these are five rolls and they're a pound each. They're normally a bit dearer in your asses and things. Um, just two boxes of cereal. I've got this Crave Roulette. Now I bought this the other day and they actually hid it from me because these are expensive. Well, this is $1.99 from Home Bargains, but like other shops it's expensive. Um, and Elliot found it and ate it and he went, oh, that cereal were nice. Anyway, I bought another one and me and Elliot can share it. I'll let him share it, you know. Um, but it is actually really nice. It is $1.99, but honestly, it's a good little treat. I just needed some more Frosties because we all eat Frosties in this house. Um, also, Elliot won't eat the fake Frosties, so I always have to buy Kellogg's. Then I just got some chocolate dimes. Now, I don't know if this is going to be a, um, a stocking filler or if to put in, oh, you can't even see through shopping. Do you know, like, in the centre of my island, I have three glass jars. One's got sweets in, one's got wrapped sweets in, and one's got, like, chocolate pods in. Oh, I forgot to get some hot chocolates. Never mind. Just means I have to go back again. Um, anyway, so I don't know if I'm going to fill that glass jar up with these. Um, I think she's going to go into a Christmas stocking. I'm not sure yet. These are the Werther's Original Soft Caramel. These are definitely going to be a stocking filler. I know who they're for. I've got these Thornton Mint Squares for my mum. I know my mum doesn't watch my videos. She probably will on this one occasion where I'm showing her what I've got. Um, but she loves um, mint chocolate and she loves Thorntons. And obviously Home Bargains add some Thorntons in. I don't think they always have Thorntons. I think it's one of those where they might have some in. I don't know. Do you know, like... If they're not selling in Thorntons, they'll pass them to cheaper stores. I could be completely lying, but that's my take on it. Um, so they add some in anyway. So I've got them for my mum. She is not allowed up there. I'll have words with her after. Um, I just needed some fabric conditioner, nothing in particular. I was hoping for a Christmas scent, but this giant bottle was on offer. It's 1.925 litres. Um, and it was 2 dollars for this giant bottle. It's in the scent Summer Vibes, which is probably why it's in the sale, but as long as it makes me close, smell nice, I'm not that fussed. So, oh, how do you know? It's like um, a mocktail. Actually, smells like a mocktail. So I'm glad about that, actually. It smells lovely. 
Um, I just got this at Zephora in the spray to try because I've seen a few people mention this purely on the smell, Midnight Bloom, and it's just meant to be really nice. I have had a few sprays because if Betsy does go up there, I obviously need to sanitise every time. So I have had a few squirts already and it is actually amazing. It also says it's a 24 hour fragrance as well. So that's really good. Um, you can use it on your worktop, sinks, taps, draining boards, cookers, hobs, bins, toilets, baths and showers, tiles and hard floor and hard surface pet areas. Ideally not the kitchen worktop. But for this giant bottle, it was 1.99 as well. A few more bits and then onto the decorations. Um, I've got this cute little cup. I normally get from Home Bargains, they have like Elf and Santa ones, like beakers, and I do normally get me only do one of them. But when I moved house, we binned all them because I'd had them for a few years and it's like normal wear and tear kind of thing. But I thought this one, okay, I'm acting a bit childish now, but I just thought this one's so cute. It's got little snowflakes on and it says Magical Christmas. I don't think Lady will use this one, but I will. So I'm excited about that. And this one was only a pound. So if you've got little children or even adults that like these, then they're a pound. So grab a bargain on them. Then I saw this. Now I went to, at the weekend, I went to a vegan fair and I saw quite a few of these. So I picked it up based on what I'd seen at the weekend, to be honest. Um, but this is a shampoo and conditioner bar. So I don't know how good... I'm skeptical because I don't know how good this is going to work. It's like in a bar to shampoo your hair. Also, I don't like shampoo and conditioners in one. Um, but what I thought was, well, it looks like this. Elliot loves this banana anyway. So if they just use it as soap, that's fine by me. Um, it do, this does say it's 97% plant-based. So it's not 100% if you are vegan. But with this, you don't get any plastic waste, which is brilliant. Right, a little baby one here, guys. This might be my first baby purchase on my hauls. I might do like a whole different video showing you what I've got for baby so far. But it's just some little babes. These are the Tommy Tippy ones and the milk feeding babes. And I thought these were absolutely brilliant. Purely because I remember feeding mine and milk in the tiny little necks milk it kind of gets in all the creases under here and you have to you know get the bib right under well this has got like a little padded um like neck bit you know to try and kind of absorb all that milk that goes under and i thought that was brilliant if i'm honest there were no price so i don't have a clue how much these were but i'm just really pleased that i found them because i thought they were brilliant um but baby Z, i'll give you an update a few months ago yeah there guys right on to the Christmas stuff, I'm so excited. Okay, so first, I've got this Merry Christmas side. Betsy's enjoying the haul, clearly. Merry Christmas, and I think this was £1.50, guys. And I thought that was really good. I'm planning on having it in my lounge window on the inside. Um, if it'll stay, if I can get it to stay up and have it hanging in there. By the way, this glitter is lethal. My shopping bag is covered up like this. I'm surprised there's any left on it, to be honest. Then I got two, oh, did you see it all fly off then? That's from that blooming sign. I got two of these, because I thought these were super pretty. And my main tree, um, I normally decorate in white decorations, which I'm gonna try and continue this year, even though we're getting a real tree this year. Um, but I thought these can add on with them. And I think they're either a pound or like one pound ten or something ridiculous like that. So I love them. I did get two in red a few weeks ago as well um, for when my Christmas tree arch comes and I do that all in red. Going with the Christmas tree arch, got two big lollipops. Again, I don't know how much these were. I feel like they might have been one pound fifty, but I just know that I definitely wanted them. So price wasn't really an issue. Oh, it's, oh, it's two ninety nine, two ninety nine each. <laughs> but like I say, I definitely wanted them. I want them to hang out of my um, tree arch. Um, so I'm really pleased with them. The non so home bargains have been having. I think I said at the beginning, like the giant big candy canes and the big sweets. And they didn't have none. They had some in green and they had some in pink. Didn't have um, no red and white ones, which were a bit sad about, but it's not meant to be. But I'll keep trying every day till I get some. 
but they did have these ones and this kind of compensates almost i do love these um so they have this like red and white like striped candy canes um and you know i'm sure these are like 3.99 or something like that pricing on but honestly these were something like 3.99 and i thought that were really good because the bigger size barbells than the normal ones so i've got three of these now all i'm gonna say on this is these would be perfect for someone's christmas eve boxes if you know someone that has a christmas eve box that's all i'm gonna say they are instant hot chocolate powder with marshmallows um, at the top so that's a super cute little christmas eve box i think were they a pound or pound 50 i'm sure they were a pound actually i just got some suction hooks because these are super handy all year round to be honest whether it's um, Halloween, Easter, Christmas, birthdays, whatever the occasion may be, these are always good to have. Um, so I'll use one of them on my big glitter Merry Christmas on the window. And that's a pack of 24 suction hooks. My table is literally covered in silver glitter. That's going to be bald after this year, I can feel it. Then I've got two like little um, like ornament decoration bags, if you will, storage bags. This one, um, looks like like this so i'm guessing it's like oval well you can see it's round a circle shape um and then it's like long so you can put all your barbels in um i don't think it's like they'd fit in but do you know literally like barbels just barbels that basically will go in this one um and i think these were 3.99 i do show it on my come shop with me so have a look on that if you're not sure um but I've been meaning to get these kind of storage things each year and I don't know if they sell out or I forget or what, but I've never got around to getting them. So this time I got two to make sure I got them. This is the other one. So this is like a plastic box, but this holds up to 64 barbells, which is amazing because you can, can you see how you can take that, you can take like the plastic insert out. Um, so if, the, if you've got big ones, like them big stripy ones, you don't need to have the insert in. It can just like go on a layer and then you can put another layer on top. So this is gonna be perfect. So I've got like, plus I'm doing my um, triage as well by the patio door. I'm gonna have like two lots of um, Christmas decorations to put away. That will definitely come in handy. For Betsy's tail. <laughs> Dangling. Um, right, next I've got this little ribbon. Now this was in the section where you um, like wrap presents up, you know, you put the ribbon around the presents. And as much as I do want ribbon to put around presents, I feel like this is too nice to do that. So this might actually go on my triage as well, guys, to be honest. I'm not sure yet, but I feel like it's way too nice to put around presents. I don't even know if that's what it, its purpose is, but I feel like that's too beautiful to do that. Um, and I think that was one pound as well, which is amazing. Um, right, these giant barbells. So, I've got this one and it's almost like a winter scene inside a barbell. Honestly, I saw these and I just knew I was getting them. I wasn't sure where I was going to put them at the time, but I've had a think and I know. So this one's got like almost a little fake Christmas tree in the middle and some little pine cones. And then I got one of each, and this was the other style they had. Oh, that's how I shook up. Um, and this is like a fake snow and then just pine cones. And there was some berries somewhere, but I guess they've all got mixed up in it. Um, and these were $2.49 each, so maybe not that cheap, but still, I think they're beautiful. Um, I don't know if you can see the size, but I'll put it next to my head. <laughs> you can kind of see what size they are. So what I'm going to do with these is above my, um, obviously this is my big dining table, and it sits one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It sits seven people, so you can guess how, how big it is. And I'm gonna have them like dangling from the ceiling. That's my vibe. That's what I'm hoping to go for. So I just need to like find some good command hooks, maybe that I can hang them from the ceiling with. I've got mail please with them. And I'll just put them on like some string, you know, like and just hang them. Right. <sighs> Nearly done. I've got this now i'm not gonna lie this is for me but it was with the christmas gifts but it's literally um so it's like a phone so led light with phone holder and desktop tripod handle 
So it basically comes like this. You've got a light, a tripod with your phone on as well. Now I have about, I'm not gonna lie, I have about 10 tripods, but I'm always trying to find the perfect one for me. So like when I do my come shop with me, I don't tend to use one because the big and bulky and everyone stares at you and things like that. So I'll, have, I'll open now and we'll have a look. And if this is more subtle, then I can use these for my come shop with me. And it also means that my videos might be steadier. I might not give people travel sickness then <laughs> if I'm using a tripod. So when you open it, it's got your light here. got stuff flying at you that's obviously a fern holder bit that's just put in place and this is the actual tripod bit so i wonder if you can like have it like this and then it also okay guys i'm not just gonna mess with it because i've no idea what i'm doing but either way it looks good that's what it looks like and it has three different lights colour, shades, whatever. Um, I think it was about £8, but I think that's actually very, very, very reasonably priced for what it is. That is what I'm going to say on that. Now, for some this little girl in my life. I just needed to get her a few stocking fillers. It isn't from my little girl. It's one that's a little bit younger. Um, so I've got this Poopsie Surprise. And it's like got some little bath flakes, love hearts, and three poops. <laughs> bath bombs and I believe inside this bit there's like a slime surprise of some sort I'm not sure but I know she'd probably like that along with that I got this oops this poop set slime surprise again and this is a makeup and hair set so you get three tubes of lip gloss two pots of nail polish and two pots of glitter so it's perfect for the little diva in the making um, and then I got this mermaid slime. I'm not sure, but basically you've got your slime kit, you've got your like beads, you've got some glitter and you've got like half a mermaid tail and you can mix it all in your slime to make it how you want. Make the slime however, how you want. You can put the tail in or you can just put the beads in, whatever. And that was £1.99. So great little stocking filler as well. Then this is another stocking filler and I think this is brilliant. So it's got this brush and it's a detangling brush. So if you know someone whose hair's very long, this will be perfect to help detangle it and get all the knots out after the shower. And also it comes with a hair wrap and I think that's really good as well because I actually have a hair wrap and I think they're brilliant. Um, I do swear by hair wraps. So I think this was about 2 99 and I thought that's a perfect cute little mini teenager gift set if you will needed some Christmas tags so I'm kind of going for a red and brown like Christmas wrapping the theme this year so for all these I think it might have been a pound which is probably standard price oh god this is heavy for one of my dear friends who loves a good drink I've got this gift set this was 10 99 and you get a little bottle of Prosecco and then I guess you get let me have a look where does it say so it's a bottle of Prosecco and it's a bottle of the Galuvian. <laughs> can never say that. Like the Belgian little chocolates and like in little love hearts. That's super cute. But I just like how it's like in a cute gift set like that as well. Then for all the poopsy things for my little girl in my life, um, I just got this gift bag, which was 79 pence and I thought, it's even the Me To You Tatty Teddy range, and that was 79 pence, guys. That was really good. Um, so I've got that to put everything in, and then I've got one more present to show you, and then I'm done. And then you can go and refill your cuppa, because I'm sure you need it. I got this. So this was um, for a friend's son. Now, I was gonna go to Lush and get him some bath bombs, but honestly, I saw this and I thought, do you know what? Kids probably appreciate having more things than pricier things. Does that make sense? So Lush, you might get one, I don't know, bath and, bath and shower gel and one bath bomb for £10. Whereas this was £10 for all that. And honestly, I think this looks loads better. I feel like if I was a 12 year old, I'd appreciate this and much more than a Lush bath set with hardly anything in it. So you would get
seen it somewhere. It tells you how many you're getting here. Mm. I swear I've seen it somewhere. It actually tells you. I'm sure it's like 28 or 30 or something bath bombs. Can't remember. But like I say, I think just as a child receiving this, I think it just looks exciting and a lot more appealing than one um, shower gel and bath bomb. So I'm excited to give him that. Right guys, like I said, that is it for today's Home Bargains haul. If you did like it, please do like and subscribe because honestly, just by doing that, it supports me so much and I appreciate every single one of you, I really do. Um, and keep your eyes peeled for lots more Christmas videos coming up. Um, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.